The planets have aligned. El Nino has awoken. I've had my breakfast and taken my morning dump. And the summer equinox has reached its peak. Actually, that was two days ago. But that's the kind of show this is. Old news. Netlink Daily. Was it two days ago? Yeah. Really? Yeah. I had no idea that was topical. I just made that up. It's actually five days ago, apparently. Thank you, Anthony. Right on. So PCI Express is one of the fastest connectors out there, and it's about to get faster soon. But that is to say, if 2017 is soon. I don't know, this isn't a great watch. I can't really tell what time it is. The PCI Special Interest Group has announced that version 4.0 of the interface will be finalized in 2017 and will support up to 16 giga transfers per second, which equates to around two gigabytes per second per lane and 31 gigabytes per second per X16 slot. That's pretty much double what the current PCIe 3.0 slots can handle at the moment. Now, 4.0 will use a new interface, but will also be somewhat backwards compatible with 3.0. So old cards can be used in 4.0 slots. However, new 4.0 cards will not work in 3.0 slots. So prepare your butts for an upgrade, whether you like it or not, sometime after 2018. And that sounded super sketch, man. Google Fiber is making progress, hooking up parts of the USA to ridiculously fast internet. But things are looking better up here in Canada too. Bell, one of the big ISPs in the Great White North, just announced Gigabit Fiber, an internet service launching in Toronto. Five. No R. That's stupid. I know, I made a joke about it at the end. <laughs> which will bring speeds up to 940 megabits per second. I mean, really, Bell? You couldn't get the extra 60 to hit 1,000? I mean, I guess you also couldn't put the extra R at the end of Google Fibe. So, whatever, I'll just move to South Korea where they have gigabit over the air. And good old lithium batteries may be getting a performance boost thanks to that magical cure-all material, graphene. Samsung researchers say they've developed a new cathode material coated with high crystalline graphene to double the capacity of ordinary lithium ion batteries. So we could be seeing longer lasting batteries in the future, or we could get even thinner phones with exactly the same battery life that wasn't acceptable now and won't be acceptable then. Someone's gonna clue in eventually. Someone is gonna look at the Droid Turbo and be like, wow, do people actually buy that thing? What's good about it? Oh, it has a huge battery in it. Quick bits, the much anticipated OnePlus 2, the three, will be unveiled July 27th, complete with its USB type C port at an event that will be viewable through VR. Woo, better buy it then. Arcos has entered the expanding PC on an HDMI stick market with the aptly named Arcos PC stick for $99. Fleer, Flyer? What the hell is that thing called? FLIR. Thank you, FLIR. FLIR has launched their second gen thermal camera for use in iPhones with the Android version coming in July. EA's chief operating officer, Peter Moore, claims that the company will have no qualms about delaying the launch of Star Wars Battlefront if needed. That strategy worked really well with Battlefield Hardline, which had a much smoother launch than Battlefield 4, and perhaps some other developers should take this to heart. <laughs> uh, new sources for all of today's stories can be found in the forum post linked in the description. Hakuni Matatas! Uh, I think you're thinking of Hakuna Matata, which is uh, Pumba for thank you very much. That was a delicious meatloaf. It's 2015. Time for you to make a website that looks like it was made in and for 2015. Squarespace can help with that. Their easy to use tools allow you to make your own website, blog, or online store using their elegant interface. Beautiful templates, and they've got 24 seven customer support with layouts that automatically optimize themselves for viewing on a PC, tablet, or even on mobile. Tablets are also mobile. PCs can be mobile too, but you tried real hard, Keys. Then if you want to get into the Nitty gritty of the site code, the Squarespace developer platform gives you full control over your site's HTML, CSS, and JavaScript as well. There's literally no downside, unless you count having a badass website as a downside. That would be stupid. So go to squarespace.com slash NCIX to start a free trial, no credit card required, and you'll get a 10% discount on the first purchase of their very reasonable plans. Mm. All right, that's it for Netlink Daily, guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX. Now I have to go. My planet needs me or I'll miss the wormhole and never discover the meaning of life. Murph, I'm coming for ya! Who's Murph?
you get this is Ghostbusters? Grabbing them Interstellar? Eh? Murph? No. I've yeah. never seen Interstellar. Arf. What the hell are you doing? Matthew McConaughey. Oh. Matthew McConaughey. Yeah, I'm not a huge Matthew McConaughey fan. Is he in it? <laughs> it's like some actors, you know, man. Like Matthew McConaughey. No, man. Sandra Bullock. No, man. What? What about Sandy Bullock? No, 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 no. That's How fair. dare you? That's fair. Matthew McConaughey. Sandy Bullock. He's, he's the new Marlon Brando. <laughs> How? That's such nonsense. I'll prove it. No.